guys, welcome back, Vendetta HD here, or Josh. Today's video, we'll be taking a look at my Xbox One Games Collection. It's gonna sound very, very old, like Games Collection. Why? Well, we've done my PS3 collection, old phones collection. Now, let's do a Xbox One collection. Why? Just because. Why not? So first off, we have, I'm not gonna do these in order, scratching our idea. Basically, just gonna do the ones I have that are on disc. So, first off, we have Advanced Warfare. It's playing it today, great game. People may not have liked it, I liked it, really fun. It's a few years old now. I don't know, noise, I don't know. But Advanced Warfare is a great game, I loved it compared to Ghost. Ghost was alright, interesting and make the cuts. Let's put that over there. Ghost never made the cuts, it will. Then we have Watch Dogs. This is the original Watch Dogs that came out for the Xbox One, of course. All these games came out on. Xbox, except Halo and some other games. But Watch Dogs was still fun, I did like this as well. And this was a really, like, people said it was a bad game, but when I bought it, I bought it because hacking is such an interesting, like, thing in the modern world today. Now, I only realized what I did last video. I was trying to put these in order when I bought them, which was a stupid idea because I bought my, I got my Xbox in 2015. Next up, Battlefield 4. I got it. My, what was it? My brother got my dad's Xbox, and I borrowed this game from him. And uh, Battlefield 4. I like the concept. I like modernized games. Battlefield 3 was amazing. I don't have it on Xbox One. I have it on PS3 because it came out for PS3. <laughs> what was it? But Battlefield 4, extremely hard game. Jesus Christ, but still fun. Isn't it all of it? Uh, you gotta be like moved out. Next up, we have the very famous Infinite Mean Fear, as I like to call it. Nah, I'm joking. Infinite Warfare, Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered. Solid answer. Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, a 5 out of 10, Modern Warfare Remastered, despite everything else. A 10 out of 10. Modern Warfare Remastered, Call of Duty 4 is our first game, so I can't really hate on that. Well, my first game, my first Call of Duty, yeah. Next up, Battlefield 1. I switched, I bought Battlefield 1 because I wanted to try it out, as I have played Battlefield before. I may be a COD fan, but Battlefield is still a good game. Very intriguing, very interesting, fun. You don't die oftenly, so that's a good thing. Yeah, I stay alive in this game. It's just the vast way of, I don't know, I do enjoy playing this game. The other one it is, is just, if you play this game for about two weeks, get back on Call of Duty, I know it still is different. So I say fast, slow pace in the middle. Creepy bone. Put that by there. Next up, probably one of my favorite Call of Duty's to date. Well, Black Ops 2 still holds that, but Black Ops 3 is another one that holds the what was it favorite Call of Duty's. I have the hand edition that comes with a steel case and very nice by there with some artwork, which I'll show you right now. So if you got a higher edition, you want to go artwork of the, what was it, the specialists in the game. So we have a Spectre here. It says all the stuff in the back. You can Google all this, but yeah, Spectre here. I'm going to get these framed. And you have a uh, Tempest by you. Really cool. These are really nice images as well. Um, what was it? We have Outrider. What was it? What else? We've got Ruin. Oh, God. Hold up. Ruin by here. Looking pretty badass. We've got, if I remember correctly. Reaper, nice. That's so like. What weapons are you using? Oh, it's the Cuda. I couldn't tell. And um, then we have my personal favorite, which I've used so many times. Nomad. Um. Just. I can never pronounce her name. Never pronounce her name. And also we have here we have uh, what was a firebreak. That's another one. We're gonna get these frames because these are awesome. Um. Then we have battery. What was it? A Black Ops 3 specialist system was great. And to have all of these, these are great. These are nice feeling cards as well. Which I'll probably frame most of them. Which are very, very, very nice. Like, the image quality is just like so fine, detailed. It's amazing. Next game, which I'll get to now. As soon as I put these back in their little uh, case, which they came in. Like, what was cool is, when I got these, entirely, I looked at the back and I'm like, ooh, what's this? So I knew 
if you bought the hard edition, you knew what the specialists were and their names and stuff. Well, you in the beta, but like you knew what this stuff did. What's this? Uh, heat wave for the fire break. Rapid cycling. It says here. Please focus. As it says there, rapid cycling heat sink, sinks dump a stored thermal charge which stuns enemies. It's annoying and hey, it uh, drives me nuts. But yeah, enough of that. Put that back in this case. When she comes in, it's a cool little case. I do like it. Very fancy. I might buy the Call of Duty World War II like, special edition, like the Deluxe edition or something, if I have enough money for it. But yeah, Black of Shree, amazing. Very amazing. There. What was it? Dead Rising 3. I loved the second Dead Rising when I played at my friend's house. It was a we it was like a pretty out of zombies. Zombies is one of those games where it's like, ooh, let's just got a killing spree with zombies. Uh, if a zombie apocalypse happened, I'd be that'd be great. And everyone's like, ooh, it's from Capcom. Well, it's funny enough. I've played Dead Rising, but I've never played a Resident Evil game. That's probably really weird. Next up, I'll give these as two. We have course. Halo Master Chief Collection with Halo 1, 2, 3, and 4, my opinions, love them all. The thing is though, I played Halo 1 and 2 on the original Xbox, which is, uh, which is uh, over, over there in the right hand corner, if you can see it. Right there, on my Xbox. That's a limited edition, like, silver Xbox that I had. Nice console. I don't want this footage stuff on the top, it's just like flashing. Not the image. I don't know why it does that. Weird. But yeah. The first Halo, like Halo Combat Evolved, Halo 2, what was it great? When I got to play Halo 3 on the 360, Uncle 360, a blast. Then Halo 4, the definitive. Halo 5 was a different story. Still a fun game. I'm waiting for Halo 6. It left off on another cliffhanger. All out, Halo has been my favourite, like, first person shooter. Halo has been. Just, uh, just everything. I've played Halo since I was six, so it's like, I have to praise my, um, what, what got me into playing Call of Duty. So, yeah. So, Halo, Halo was great. I'll hold up. Put on there. So, they're all over there now, but don't worry. Next up, GTA 5. Out of all the Grand Theft games I've played, by City San Andreas, Grand Theft Auto 5 is my favourite. Great story, great online that people still play today. Funny enough, I have this on PS3, Xbox One, and PC. I bought it, I told you it three times. Holy crap. But still, this game, when I, I first got it on PS3, because that's why I had the time, and didn't have an Xbox One, but it came in 2014. I was like, I first saw it at a, like a friend's house on the 360, I was like, whoa, this is cool. And then when I saw Syndicate playing, I was like, this looks interesting. I like the look of this. Got it. PS3, amazing. And as soon as I got on the Xbox version, because, do keep in mind, my PS3 port, my, on my, my PS3, of course, the HDMI port, broke. So I was playing in the Scott Component video. So, not HD. So when I first saw it was in HD, I didn't want to go back. Try not to either. I went, on, I went back on it to see how much money I had. I had like 2 mil, which was funny. But yeah, oh, clicky clicky, then da da sucky sucky, then da da sucky sucky. <laughs> Next up, yeah, I have more games digitally, so this will be there will be a part two to this once I turn my Xbox on and get it recorded. Next up, we have The Walking Dead season two, which I'll put right here. What can I say about season two? I haven't completed it yet. I haven't completed it, but so far, if I remember correctly, it's going great. The first season completed that. Actually, no, did I? No. I only completed episodes 1 to 2 because I didn't have them from, on PS3. So when I had them, like, I'm still, I've seen the story. The story's great. I can't wait for season 3, which I'm gonna, what I might do is restart them over again so it carries on my works in the next game. Telltale Games is great. I love how he made The Walking Dead into, like, a story. It's, it's, sort of, it's like how a Minecraft story mode works. You, like, you listen to the game, you can still walk around, do stuff. We gotta answer questions fast and stuff. Next up, Koji Ghosts. Ghosts wasn't half bad. It got a lot of shit, a lot of hate, but to be honest, Ghosts, it wasn't that bad. The multiplayer could have had a lot more work done. But, 
I think they focus on the campaign a lot. But do remember, the Koji Go cycle of development was interrupted. Go Google why. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna explain it. But still, Ghost was okay. The multiplayer was a bit. Mm. But next up on the first part, Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Still playing it. Still a great game. Not because it's a Syndicate in it. It's British. And it's just so fun. I get to go. To, what was it? There's not many games based in London, and there's still not a lot of games based where I live. So I don't know if there is any at all. But the place I'm in that is country like with so it's like it's, it's near my country pretty much but i know people don't like ubisoft but i can't wait for the upcoming assassin's creed origins origins it is i can't, I can't remember what it was i think it's that but this is doing so great i still love it i love like what was it i like sneaky games i i, I love the first second first and second assassin's creed i'm in the third which is weird but it's great the fighting mechanics need to be fixed, but I saw that from the Assassin's Creed Origins gameplay, like gameplay thing they showed off at E3. But this is great, Michael Player actually. So so far, that are all my physical copy of the game, and these aren't all the digital ones. So we'll be back to a part two, following up all the digital ones on my console. Hope you liked the video. Make sure to like and subscribe for more content like this. As I do like collecting stuff. Well, next up, I could do my shoe collection, which I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pairs of shoes. I am not rich, I just screw a lot. But yes, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.